Herman Emil Louis Fischer FRS FRS EFCS the 9th of October 1852 to the 15th of July 1919 was a German chemist and 1902 recipient of the Nobel Prize in Chemistry. He discovered the Fischer esterification. He also developed the Fischer projection, a symbolic way of drawing asymmetric carbon atoms. He never used his first given name and was known throughout his life simply as Emil Fischer. Early years Fischer was born in Euskirchen, near Cologne, the son of Laurens Fischer, a businessman, and his wife Julie Poensgen. After graduating he wished to study natural sciences, but his father compelled him to work in the family business until determining that his son was unsuitable. Fischer then attended the University of Bonn in 1871, but switched to the University of Strasbourg in 1872. He earned his doctorate in 1874 under Adolf von Bayer with his study of Thalens and was appointed to a position at the university. Research Fischer is noted for his work on sugars, among other work, the organic synthesis of D plus glucose and purines including the first synthesis of caffeine. Fischer was also instrumental in the discovery of barbiturates, a class of sedative drugs used for insomnia, epilepsy, anxiety, and anesthesia. Along with the physician Joseph von Mehring, he helped to launch the first barbiturate sedative, Barbital, in 1904. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Honors, awards, and legacy. In 1897 he put forward the idea to create the International Atomic Weights Commission. Fischer was elected a foreign member of the Royal Society in 1899. Many names of chemical reactions and concepts are named after him. fischer tropsch process is named after Franz Emil Fischer a chemist who was no relation, head of the Max Planck Institute for Coal Research in Mülheim. References Topic. External links Nobel Lecture Syntheses in the Purine and Sugar Group from NobelPrize.org website Eminent Chemists of Our Time by Benjamin Harrow Pages 216-239, published 1920 by von Nostrand Company at books.google.com Guide to the Emil Fischer Papers at the Bancroft Library Textbook of Physiological Chemistry in 30 Lectures by Emil Abderhalden, translated by William Thomas Hall and George Defren, published 1908 by Wiley Company, has many technical references to Fisher's work in chemistry. American Journal of Diseases of Children 1911 Volume 2 by the American Medical Association also refers to Fisher's work. An Introduction to the History of Medicine, with Medical Chronology by Fielding Hudson Garrison, page 708 refers to Fisher and Mehring's discovery of the drugs Varinal and Proponal published 1921 by Saunders Company. 1914 Year Book of the American Pharmaceutical Association, page 438 Abstracts Fisher and Strauss's work on phenol glucosides, synthetic production from Berlin D. D. Chem. Germany, page 45, 1912, number 12. Texts on Wikisource. Fischer, Emil. New International Encyclopedia, 1905. Fischer, Emil. Encyclopedia Britannica, 11th ed., 1911. Fischer, Emil. Encyclopedia Americana, 1920.